so happy to be here with Harp Gathering for the concert series and I'm so excited that they found a way to put a little online for you to hold you until 2021 where hopefully we can all be together in Ohio for Harp Gatherings. That was Upon the Willows by Brooke Bodie. I am very excited because as a non-composer just performer teacher type, I don't write my own music. But thanks to some dear friends and composers that I even don't know, I found out that you can indeed get permission to perform their pieces and share them with the world so that hopefully I play something maybe that you've never heard before and you're like, wow, I like that and you'll order it and some other things that you'll try. So I'm gonna introduce you to a lot of people hopefully tonight. This next composer is Cindy Hortzman, and she is from and in Texas. And this piece is called Lullaby.
Starts New Jersey, school teacher as most of you know. I teach grades K to. I did teach K to 12. Now, thank goodness, I teach six to eight. And um, you know, it's just it's just always really nice to be able to teach in a public school district, but in the district and in a lot of the music education programs, we also need, we have tons of harp music and I'm blessed that all I teach is harp, right? It's a really fabulous thing, but none of the New Jersey core curriculum standards or the music standards deals with harp music in any of their questions and any of the standardized tests, which now music is on. So I'm excited to play a piece arranged by Angie Bemis and in Balfour Knight. And this piece um, is Essence of the Swan, from the swan that so many of you know. And uh, the other piece is Tremorai by Schumann that they have arranged. The importance for me with pieces like these is I can work with my students both on the beautiful classical and popular and jazz harp music that we love, but also on music that they might see on those standardized music tests. So for anyone who wants to play classical music that's not harp music, I'd love you to hear these arrangements. Thank you. 
And for some of us, we grew up with so many of those songs on Bugs Bunny and any kind of cartoon that we could find. Back again to Brooke Bodie. This is an arrangement of His Eye is on the Sparrow. Should I feel discouraged? Cindy Hortzman, Texas. This is her piece called Angelica.
Angelica, Cindy Hortzman from Texas. So I love just the different stories. I love the traveling and getting to travel and meeting so many different people. And that's one of the things that we really miss now. I hope that we'll be able to see you in person live 2021 and that we will just all be safe until that time and doing what all harpists know. So yes, it is kind of a heat wave here and even under these lights. So you see me and any of you who know me, this is live concert. So this is off live, sweaty and everything. And even the strings are complaining a little bit about it. But I'd like to leave you with a piece by Deborah Hudson Conant, The Nightingale. Everybody stay safe. Thank you.